Hi, this is Joe from Prep Agent. I'm here with my friend Kevin Steenbergen out of beautiful Colorado, the Rocky Mountains. Um, I love that city. Been there many times. It's very pretty. Nice. And my understanding is you just passed and you want to help other people get past and get their career going. So I'm going to let you take it away. But before you do that, I want to remind everybody to click on the show notes below. I have links to Kevin's information so you can find out more about him and what he's doing in Colorado. So with that being said, Kevin. Nice. Well, thank you very much. I, I really appreciate this uh, moment in the spotlight. I, uh, I actually had uh, gone through school and taken the national and Colorado test, passed them both about seven years ago, but I never got my license. Uh, I just kept working in the industry that I was in at the time and uh, plugging away, uh, liked my job and my wife had been in real estate. And for the last several years, she'd just been killing it in real estate. And I always kind of think about getting into it. And finally, I decided that I was going to go ahead and went online and I knew I was going to have to go through some sort of study app. And I found one and all I got out of it was what I needed to study, a list of things, and um, and some questions, a few practice questions, and it was it was actually worthless. And started looking on YouTube, found you, Joe, and started watching. Yeah, the the hat is what sold me on it, <laughs> and that's what I uh, um, I started watching the videos. And then I, as I watched the videos, I knew I went I went on your website and wanted to use your program. Um, actually found, I think it was a 25% off coupon or something floating out, floating around out there. So I signed up and it, three weeks, three weeks of, I, I was driving in my car cause I drive a lot, um, listening to all the audio, uh, stuff and even flipping through the uh, YouTube, uh, or the videos, uh, obviously not watching them cause I'm driving, but just listening, listening to it over and over and over again all day. <laughs> Um, and, and within three weeks, I, I went ahead and set my date because that's kind of my personality. Once I set the date, I, I have something to work towards and kept listening and studying and studying and boom, went in and uh, passed the national with 88%, passed the state with 82%. Um, and boom, I'm already, I'm already working. Uh, I had an open house just yesterday and I've only had my license for about a week now. So. Great, congratulations. And before we start recording, you were mentioning about acronyms. Yeah, yeah, it was, it was so cool because as I'm taking the test, because I'm, I'm listening to your audio stuff and, you, and you're, you're kind of like me, you're kind of goofy and, and, you, and you give people funny ways to remember things and uh, the acronym STUD when it comes to value. And I couldn't tell you what those, <laughs> what those words are uh, it, right now. And then when I was taking the test, uh, I, I got the value question and, and I just knew stud cause I had heard it so many times stud or dust or, you know, all of them. So I went through the answers and there was only one answer that had that acronym of stud. Uh, same was for Maria when it comes to fixtures. Um, I couldn't tell you what the, what Maria stands for, but that acronym stood out in my mind. And so just boom, for, my, for everybody, scarcity, transferability, utility, demand, and Maria, <laughs> naturally relationship, intention, and agreement. But yeah, point. yeah, <laughs> but and I knew them when I was studying, it's just when I sat down to take the test. And of course, now that the test is over, um, you know, I'm just focusing on, on learning the business and, and getting involved in uh, the business of real estate. So, so yeah, your, your program was amazingly helpful. Thank you, Kevin. And so now you're going to be a husband and wife team. Correct. Right now uh, we're, we're in a program um, that, can I mention the company that we work for? Sure, go ahead. Where we're with Remax of Pueblo and Pueblo West out here in Colorado, and uh, and she is uh, my mentor. So my wife, I, I joke around that my wife is my boss all the time now. So uh, so yeah, she's my mentor because she's like I said, she's been in the business for about seven years, uh, and I I kind of understand a little bit of it, but uh, just right now learning the contracts and everything else. So that's great. You have her to work with. Obviously, you guys have a strong relationship, or else you wouldn't have embarked on this. <laughs> so that, that's awesome. And so just to reiterate to everybody, I'm really interested to see how Kevin proceeds in his career. And we're going to follow him via the links below he provides us in the show notes. And you're in Colorado, a certain town you want to mention so people can look for you? Pueblo and Pueblo West. Uh, it's Pueblo, about Pueblo. half an hour south of Colorado Springs. Oh, okay. All right. So you're near the university. Correct. Absolutely. Okay. Yeah. So 
I believe that's Colorado State University. Correct. CSU Pueblo, Thunderwolves. Got it. All right. So if you guys are looking for property in that area, make sure you look for Kevin there. And we'll include the name of that in the show notes as well. Because not only do we want you to pass the exam, I want you to be successful in real estate. I try and tell people at all time. The goal is not pass the exam. The goal is to enjoy a new career. And so hopefully people will help you do that and support you as you're helping everybody else get ready for passing the exam. Nice. So, with that being said, anything else? Thank you, Joe. Thank you, prep agent. Uh, I honestly believe I would still be studying if it wasn't for you, but now I'm working. So All right. it's awesome. So this is Joe from prep agent with Kevin and I'll talk to everybody later. Bye. Thanks. <laughs>